You want to be champion. You got to climb the ladder. <laughs> One step at a time. Well said, champ. This is that slow burn. Still got the raindrops falling. It's not high intensity. It's low intensity. We just burning it out, man. Is there a certain speed you put this contraption on, or is it just on your own push? It's on your own push, on your own drive. I want to pick it up, it gets picked up. See what I'm saying? That's not the zone right now. We got other times, other workouts, where we work that in. High intensity climb on the ladder. It's just a slow burn, man. Takes it back to the little engine that could. Chug, 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 chug. <laughs> but the ladder ain't gonna stop. So it stops when you stop. Uh. Speaking in parables, huh? There's a message in everything. <laughs> they think we're gonna, they wanna know if one time gonna be headstrong. Mentally strong? Oh, we always come in headstrong. But this training camp is about being leg strong. You'll see March 4th what that produces. We worked a lot on our lower body. We worked a lot on our core this, this go around. And we're hoping to produce that knockout victory for you guys. Concentrating on your core, uh, you know, that's gonna that's gonna that's gonna give you a lot of more oomph on your punches. You know, a lot of power comes from the core. Are you uh, looking to power punch uh, in this fight? We power punch every fight, man. <laughs> you saw Sean uh, Sean Porter get rocked. He That's just right. didn't get stopped. You know what I mean? We'll see what Danny can take. And, you know, there's people that hit home runs, but they don't hit home runs every game, man. You know what I'm saying? So, just like the different pitches, Styles makes fights. And we, we coming for Danny Garcia. That's all we can do. You know, a lot of people talk about Danny's uh, timing being great, which it is. And, uh, you being more of a, you know, seen as a cerebral fighter. What about your timing? How do you, how do you, how do you push yourself in, in your timing? Are you, in, 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 if you were gonna uh, rate it, how good is your timing? Is that something that you? Uh, my timing's pretty good, man. It's gotten a lot better throughout the years. I've watched my timing develop and grow. But um, we're gonna we're gonna see how good Danny's timing is. His timing up against my timing. His speed up against my speed. His power up against my power. His will to win up against my will to win. You know, it's gonna be a terrific fight, man. Great fight. But um, if his timing is as good as everybody says it is, that ain't a problem. Then you just mix it up. You make it harder for him to time by mixing up your timing on your attack. And we'll see, we'll see how he adjusts to that. As if I even need to make that adjustment. Danny's considered to have a lot of power too. You think your movement is gonna, you know, make it very difficult for him to use that power? Is that something that you look forward to doing? Making him uh, miss or not be able to use that power that, you know, that left hook that comes from out of nowhere usually buckles his uh, opponent. We look forward to everything, man. We look forward to a great fight and a good challenge for me at this point in my career. The most important fight of my career. We ready, man. We ready for this fight. We ready to perform for the fight fans. And to keep moving up the ladder, baby. That's what it's all about. Moving up the ladder. The never ending ladder, the chance says. <laughs> And you just you just did uh, almost an hour on the Versa. Yeah. You went outside, took out two gallons of water out of your sauna suit, and you're back on here. How long are you gonna be on this, man? I mean, it really looks grueling. <laughs> ah. Short little 15, 20 minute. 
That way we get a nice full hour of cardio in. How important is your diet as a fighter? You know, to all the young up and coming fighters, you know, who probably going through their own, uh, you know, trials and tribulations uh, with dieting and physicals and being in shape to become a fighter. And, you know, how, how important is the dieting? How is it important for you to eat clean? Greens and proteins, baby. Get the carbs in the morning. Can't have no carbs at night. You can carve up before a workout, that's it. But that is real important. It facilitates weight loss during training camp. So you need that. And you feel better too. You need to feel the best you can to perform. So diet's mandatory. I had an omelet this morning. Cottage cheese. Some pistachios to get a little bit of fat. A little extra protein. A banana. Tuna salads. And uh, you know, from what we've seen, uh, I mean, you don't have really a dietitian. You usually have, uh, which, you know, you go out in the uh, city and, and you have your, you know, your particular spots where you go ahead and get your food. Um, is that something that you know, specially made from you? Do you talk to the people at the at the particular spots where you where you go? Greens and proteins, man. Greens and proteins. <laughs> you don't know how to order some greens and proteins. That's all it is. <laughs> they got something on the menu. Yeah, that's right, Kale. I do, I do a mix and match. I see some shit over here that I want over here. I tell them, put that shit on this plate. <laughs> it's called the mix and match. If you got it in the kitchen, motherfucker, you can put it on my plate. <laughs> So let me know where I can go and order the, the, the special, the mix and match special. <laughs> Greens and protein. Wow. Got H2O coming out of everywhere. <laughs> you saw that? <laughs> Hell yeah. Wow. 